Hello guys, today we're going to show you how to mirror your Android device to a Roku TV. Now, it can be any Roku TV, they should all have this uh, ability built in, except the Roku 2. So keep that in mind. So, anything lower than the Roku 2 will not work. So, first of all, go to your settings, just check if it's turned on, because sometimes it's automatically turned off. So, you want to go here, oops, gone a bit too far. There we are. Now you can either ha just have that always one on. Um, so tick that on. So, then when that's ticked on, we're going to go onto the phone. So any Android device, as I said, um, click down here. Well, this is on a Samsung, so depending on what device you're on, um, maybe located somewhere else. So we're just going to click this. And it's automatically going to detect to the TV, because I've connected before. And it won't take too long to load up. Okay, it's loaded up. So, it, you can easily um, do two things on the TV. So one, if you can't, if it's not, you can't work out how to get it off the phone, you can easily just hit stop down the bottom, or you can just scroll back down and scroll over there and hit that and hit yes. I mean okay. Okay. So when you've done that, it'll close, and the same thing applies if you want to reconnect. Just hit that again, and it'll reconnect. Now this is good if you're wanting to watch YouTube. Uh, I don't know why you'd want to mirror it. If I was mirroring, probably for uh, if I was doing web searching, because I always mirror my laptop to the Roku, so to have it as a another display, which is really good, works really well on the Windows. So basically, you could open YouTube and stuff like that, and scroll through and watch a video. Um, yeah, so it's pretty simple. Um, tell me what you think and how to uh, mirror your Android device to a Roku TV. Hope you like it. If you did, thumbs it up and subscribe for more. Alright guys, we'll catch you guys in the next one.